Hello clever people and welcome to this video which is going to be a bit particular yeah like last week's video because uh, it's the end of the year and like every end of the year it's time for balances I'm not crazy I'm just filming <laughs> okay let's roll the intro So, like every good businessman, first thing first, which is the objectives, the budget and the actual. So, at the beginning of the year, I gave myself a target, which was 28,000 subscribers and an average of 20,000 views a day. In terms of subscribers, we are there, there are a few hundreds missing, though I suppose it's okay anyway. In terms of views, we are about one half of the target. It is 6,300 roughly on average every day. So what should I say? Yeah, not particularly a good year because yes, targets were not completed. However, when I gave these targets to myself, I have to say that I wasn't really um, understanding the mechanism that YouTube is using in the sense that um, according to what can be found online and can be read apparently it seems that you need one or two breakout videos and after that the views of the channels tend to stay reasonably high uh, without pushing too much because YouTube understands that the channel is good quality so it's pushing it out to viewers ah, this actually did not understand I've had times when the average viewership was 20,000 a day and times like now uh, in which the viewership is less than 2,000 a day so it is something which is very regular and um, is this an excuse is this a reason for being in a, this condition absolutely not but yes it's something that I didn't know and it needs to be considered for the future having said this then i need to step back and think think that 28,000, 27,000, 28,000 people are so interested in what i do to subscribe the total number of views in 2020 is a bit north then two million and two hundred and yeah try to picture two million two hundred people you can't picture them in a single place it's the population of a small country it's from a certain point of view is amazing it's humbling is I couldn't really believe that what I was doing was so interesting to so many people and even the let's say the much smaller uh, core of the viewership is well uh, they're actually amazing and uh, they you are actually amazing because this video is actually for you so one thing that I notice is that the quality of the people who are watching my videos is very very high I know I always try to add some fun but my channel is not an easy channel it's a channel for people who want to think who want to learn or want to know want to uh, understand things and so there is this group of people that is now coalescing around the channel which is well really incredible from my point of view I've never thought I was going to meet these many like-minded people in uh, my career and it is yes amazing <laughs> really amazing it makes me feel way less lonely I have to say that I really wish I could hug you all without thinking about COVID obviously it's yeah it's amazing it's amazing I should be satisfied of having found some so many actually like-minded people 
Now, what should we expect for the future? Well, so one thing that, one element that is actually important is that, uh, well, I've been promoted in my daily job, the job that pays the bills, I have been promoted. So I struggled in the last few months to actually cope with the uh, pace of going out with one video a week. And also I realized that the videos that do better are the videos where I actually put some extra effort in doing a bit more research, a bit more production value, finding a bit more material that could be reused. Obviously these, these small documentaries are... Uh, uh, oh, gee. it's raining. So there is another category of people I need to say a huge thank you to them and they are my supporters on Patreon and Subscribestar. I really, really have no words to say how grateful I am and how amazing it is to think that you like what I do so much to commit financially to supporting me. Do my best to keep you informed, I will do my best to be worthy of uh, your effort uh, and particularly considering the time we are living in thank you very much i would like to say i would really love to say this to you in person and do something for you particularly and especially and uh, yes you're amazing you're simply amazing so we have seen the performance we have said thank you to the people who actually deserve this huge thank you because there are so many what's next what's going to be in the future so so the videos that turn out to be the most interesting for you are those about modern military technology when i do history there is some interest but not that much so i won't relinquish history completely because it is important to understand the time we live in but um, yes I will focus on modern technologies second I can see that the videos that are liked the most are the videos where I have pushed the extra mile tend to be a bit longer but they um, tend to be a bit more uh, well researched with some animations with some explanations and uh, these are uh, the videos I'm going to focus on there however these unfortunately are also the videos that require the most effort so so next year 2021 will be a year dedicated more to quality than to quantity i was struggling to keep the pace of one video every week because these uh, many documentaries actually require quite a lot of time to be done so i will probably go down to one video every two weeks but will be la, yeah better videos more detailed videos and uh, uh, this will be also partially uh, compensated by the fact that um, the shorts will keep coming and we'll try to drop some nuggets and answer some questions Yes, a lot of people actually are asking questions and it is only correct for me uh, to answer, okay? Uh, about 20-25% of my viewership is an Indian viewership. And Indian uh, viewers have a peculiarity of being very, very interested in anything Indian, but not particularly interested in anything um, foreign for them, obviously. And um, yes, I'm, I'm not going to abandon you, just be patient because not every video can obviously deal with any, with Indian, uh, with Indian defense. Now, another thing I would like to do is try to improve the quality of the production. Um, my patrons know that I am starting buying some extra equipment that could be useful and uh, I hope you will enjoy it. One thing that I was really surprised is was that you didn't enjoy cooperations. I mean, you should have seen 
the retention uh, chart in the video that I did with Jenny. In the minute Jenny appears on the screen, the viewership drops 3-4% and keep dropping while she's talking. Then when I go back on the video, it levels up. <laughs> that was absolutely unexpected, but okay, I understand that you don't like me cooperating with anyone else, or at least uh, you don't like anyone else being on video with me. So, yep, won't do any more. That's very strange because it's something that I really enjoyed, but I would have liked to cooperate with her and other people, to be honest, but since it seems that it's not working, well, okay, I will cease and desist. Uh, now, so, what else to say? So I think that I gave you a picture of uh, the channel of this year of being on YouTube. It's been a sort of a roller coaster for me, but um, as I said, the objectives that I set for myself, as I said before, um, are not complete, but uh, still if you consider what happened if you consider the numbers if you consider the amount of interest uh, uh human contact in conversation <laughs> sheer love compliments that i got it's yeah it's been amazing i really wish i could do something for you I really wish you to be well and safe and quiet and spend this end of year in uh, yeah in a good way in a way that is good for you and that you appreciate and could do something good for you so for those who celebrate christmas then merry christmas for those who don't well have a good end of year and all the best for what you're doing so thank you very very much for watching and see you the next time